do, do. That classic music, guys. Welcome back for another week of Star Realms. I've got another surprise for you guys. Guess what it is? Besides the music, uh, it's not that I want a game. Uh, is that last week's game, or is that a different game that I played? I don't. I don't know. I don't think I played on Steam since. I think it's all been on my phone. But here it is. Here it is. Oh, oh. <laughs> Here's the surprise. The surprise is I haven't done restore purchases and I made the purchases on my phone. So I just kind of gave everything away, didn't I? Oops. Oopsie. Okay, here's what it was supposed to look like. It was supposed to look like boop and boop. I have bases and fleets now. Isn't that exciting? Yes, yes it is. Uh, in addition, oh, sorry, really itchy. I had to do that. In addition to the core set, which of course I had because, you know, Anyway, obvious. And Colony Wars, which I picked up a while ago, I did finally pick up bases and fleets. I I guess I have to get promos because then that opens me up to the way a lot of people play. They seem to be uh, promos, bases, fleets, and then it hasn't really settled down on Corset and Colony Wars yet that much. But bases, fleets, and promos seem to be the very popular add-ons. I don't know if I want to get Gambits in events. I haven't played Gambits in paper yet, so I'm kind of curious to get it to play it, but the fact that you can't, like, turn stuff off for a quick match, I don't know. I guess I can just always do selective. Um, events I just really don't like, guys. I really I really don't like events. It's If you like it, I'm not saying you're wrong. I'm just saying to me it feels like such a different game, at least the few times I've played it in paper, that... Uh, yeah, I, if I wanted a different game, I'd play a different game. I want Star Realms. And everything else so far has felt like an addition to or a minor tweak to Star Realms. Events to me just feels like a completely different game. Anyway, I'm rambling. I should probably try to actually start a game and see if I can get this selection going. I don't know. Maybe, maybe we'll get something. And maybe it's going to take forever. So I might just cut here and come back when I have a match. Hey, I've got a game going on, Archon. I want to say Acorn. I'm sorry. Um, I must be a little touch of uh, something like dyslexia going on there. Or, I don't know. It just, that's what I want to say is Acorn. That's all I can say. Without making myself sound like more of an idiot. What have we got? We've got uh, three and two, the classic. I can't believe it's not first play turn uh yeah uh hard to say no to a frigate right um i'd love some economy but uh it's a perfect match for what i can spend and it is a really decent card so that's what we're doing the first one five on the second uh nothing that's great for five let's see if maybe they'll flip us something a little more efficiently using our stuff uh you i am not Super familiar with the customs forget. I believe this is a yep. That's what that's from is fleets You can see the little icony thing here. You may acquire a ship of cost four or less and put it on top of your deck That is an interesting one. Um, it's self scrapping. So it's probably not a horrible way to go um, But cost four or less I don't I don't particularly want cost four or less so, I'm not sure if I want to take that. I think I'd rather have a ram and hope a two comes up. Uh, Blob Fighter is definitely not a bad pair with the ram. I can't use my final, but hey, uh, at least I had two cards go together. And, uh, hmm, not this time, though. They've got five. They're probably going to go for one of those two blues, I would bet. Either the Customs Frigate or the Frontier Ferry. Yeah, they went the Frontier Ferry. Uh, trade draft too, huh? Okay. Okay, I can see that. They're a little heavily in blue, aren't they? Uh, let's see. What are we going to do? <sighs> Nothing special. Might as well just play them all. Two. I think I'm just going to take an explore is what I'm going to do, folks. It's uh, nothing great for me. So just do a little bit of damage and make them discard one this turn. Maybe it's kind of like a free turn. Maybe. And again, this is going to be six, which is still not that great. Uh, they get five, so they're probably picking up that customs frigate, I'm guessing. No? No, that's probably a smarter smarter idea. But, eh, and they'll pick up that base. Okay. 
All right, an orbital platform is not a horrible card. Um, I think I'm gonna pick that up and see what replaces it. And nothing I wanna spend three on, so hopefully the next time my ram comes up, I will be able to spend its um, trashing ability spendiness. Yes, that's what I'm calling it, trashing ability spendiness. And my opponent gets a base. Uh, it's an outpost for four, trading post, the classic guy. Uh, six, and they can go up to seven. I don't know what they're going to do with that. They're going to buy that? Okay, yeah, that makes a decent amount of sense. Okay, uh, five for me. Uh, I'm not loving that. I'm really not. I still need economy badly. Wizard needs economy badly. Oh, I wish I could buy that. Yes, I do. Yeah, let's buy the Stellar Reef. Oh, now I see yellows. Oh, what a shame. And no damage, so that's the end of my turn. They're basically getting a freebie. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. Now they have two outposts. That's awesome. They get some extra draw. Oh man, do they get to buy whatever they friggin' want. Oh, uh, they oh, they can buy the command ship, huh? Yeah, this, uh, compared to what I've been able to buy, this has been a slow-moving buy game, kind of, so... Yeah, I'm not particularly loving that. Oh... Do I even want to do that? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, I want to do that. Select the scout. Discard a card, and it's the same thing, but at least I went through a little bit more quickly. Uh, I can draw a card off of this. Let's see what that does. Target opponent discards. That does not hurt. I've got a decent amount of damage now. And get these out there. And three is a draw card with the falcon. Oh, that aging battleship doesn't look bad either, but I think I'm gonna take the Falcon. I'm just, I'm not, I'm not using up my stuff on that. So I will go ahead and take these two guys out and do a little bit of damage to their head. I'm still ahead on damage. I'm not sure how that happened with their bases and whatnot. Uh, and this next hand is not going to help out all that much. Uh, what do they get? They get six. They're probably going to get the aging battleship. No, me Mega Mech. They want the Mega Mech, don't they? Oh, is that a destroyed target base ability? Is that what that is? Yeah. Thought they wanted the Mega Mech. Oh, boy. Yeah, that makes this hand even more disappointing because I can't do anything about it. Oh, uh, I'm going to take a risk on the trade pod and hope they don't flip something better. Oh, Star Parch. I'm actually going to take that. I'm actually going to take that. I'm not entirely sure that's a good call. But I have a lot of green and a decent amount of yellow. And I don't really have much else. So I don't feel too bad about that. Alright, they're going to... Ooh, man, draw three cards. That's That bodes poorly for me. Um, and they scrap that to do something. I'm not sure what. Because there's just... More cards I'm unfamiliar with again. I've only played this like twice versus the AI since I bought these the other night. I just thought, what the heck, I'll pick up some more stuff. And boy. And if you can hear that meowing sound in the background, that is my cat, who is just normally very nice when I'm trying to play a game. But this week she decided that she wants to be part of the action. Um... Say hi. No, don't say hi. I missed someone what went on because of that, and it was bad. I know it was bad. It was just really bad. Okay, I'm going to draw a card. And my cat's going to walk in front of the screen, so I can't see what's going on. Hi. Er say hi, everybody. Say hi, Eris. Yes, she is being annoying as heck today. Uh, so I got a stellar reef out of that. That's not super exciting. Oh, I can make them discard one. That's always nice. Oh, I think I'm going to take that Parasite. Uh, waste a single point, but I don't care. Yeah. Do I want to draw out of here? Probably not. Oh, yeah, I do. 
I want to draw out of here because if I can pop a green or a yellow, that gives it one more. F oh no, the yellow wouldn't faction because yellow would be gone. Ew, no, in that case, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna end it then. <laughs> That's disappointing. And I get both the green and the yellow now. I will get a single draw, but I'm going to be drawing that last scout. So that's not super useful. It does at least put everything else to the next round, so that's something. Oh, this is an interesting trade row, isn't it? So, draw a card, draw my other scout. Go ahead and play all these guys up, which gives me six. Which, do I want this for sh six? It's, uh, put the name, no, that's only really when it allies that it's particularly good. Um, I do believe draw a card, then discard a card, and, uh, do that twice if you can ally is pretty huge. So I'm going to take that and hope I can pull it off once. And an extra Corvette, which is a draw card, is an awesome flip for me. Uh, so he will do damage, and I am getting low enough that I will probably want to make them discard a card now. Uh, yes, yes I will. And that puts us much closer in authority, and I like the look of this next hand, and if they can't make me discard more than one, I will be happy. If they can't, I'm going to be so annoyed to see such a hand, and... Uh, to have it go to waste. No, it does not go to waste. That is awesome. What can they do? Just the seven? They're trying to think about whether or not they want to take out that Stellar Reef, and they probably... Yep. Yep. There we go. Answers the question as I'm posing it. That's awesome. Uh, let's see. We have... We have... Um, six or acquire a card of... Cost six or less for free, and I'm gonna get to draw it. Which. <sighs> Man. I think I might use that on the frigate just so I can discard it for another draw. Alright, no, no, I want damage. I want damage. I really do. This is ridiculous. I want the six damage. Uh, draw some cards, guys. Draw them up. Uh, that's not particularly great. All right, all right. All of the cards. All of the cards. All right. Um. Hmm. Yeah. What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Do I want another draw? No, I really don't. I really don't. Uh, six. I think I'll take that guy and just dump him when I... Yeah. That's good enough. And then I will do that. And then I will do that. And I'm going to end my turn. I'm okay with that. I got to go quick my next turn too, don't I? Oh, well, thank you for making it so easy to go quick on my next turn. Assuming I survive it, because they should have a really good hand themselves pretty soon here, which... Seeing that draw two on the command ship makes me think this might be the turn. Okay. They're gonna get, did they get their draw? I think they did already get their draw on that. They got some scrapping. Oh, more and more draw. And they bounced their own command center. Uh, oh, shoot. Uh, that's weird. Uh, that's not the greatest thing to use that on, but I guess the extra trade is nice. The playing the Star Empire ship thing would have been nice, but ooh boy, I did not see all that damage. That was a ton. That was a ton. Oh, what a shame, but you know what? There's quite a few cards there. I just did not know how to judge. I'm going to blame it all on that entirely, or maybe on my cat for jumping in front of me. Or I just had an off game, and that is how it goes sometimes. Ah, oh, well. We have those. We all do. That's the lesson we should take away. Sometimes you'll just have an off game. But I hope you guys have a week that isn't off or is off of work. That'd be nice. Or whatever. 
I will see you guys in the next one. Later.